Eight players available for loan, Phil Handlon, Painter, Gillies, Dave Symington, we know about. Are you able to shed any light on the other, on the other four? Uh, Matty Robson, uh, Anthony Sweeney. Matty Robson, Anthony Sweeney. I've got a list on my desk. Who else was it? Alex. Uh, Alex Marrow. Connor Thompson. Connor Thompson. Mm -hmm. yeah. Right, we've kind of been yeah, already yeah, out. Yeah, yeah. Connor's gone to Penrith, hasn't he? Mm -hmm. I mean, Matty Robson, Sweeney, experienced guys, especially Matty being here a while, what's the, what's the thinking behind making those fellas available? Yeah, well, again, uh, at the time they weren't getting enough game time. Uh, and it's some, some, uh, mindful of the fact now that the longer the season goes, if they're not playing on a regular basis, week in, week out, contracts are coming to an end, they need to be playing football at this stage of their career. Um, so, and, and again, what we said to them, uh, what we said to them was that if an opportunity came around, that came along that suited them and us, uh, that we would consider it. Also, then you're taking it on board. There's, it's a realization of where they're at. Uh, if they get to the latter stages of, uh, of their contract and they're not playing, they need to be trying to secure contracts elsewhere. And whether that's that by actually going out on loan or at least verbalizing it to, to other people that they, they might that they may be available. But then, um, as and when they are still here, when they're given the opportunity to play and perform, they're using that as, a, as an ability, as an opportunity to showcase what they're about. So yeah. you know, it's a double-edged sword for themselves. You know, if they go out and perform, then the likely is people are going to be watching them, and they, they get the opportunity then to uh, to potentially get suitors for next season. If uh, I deem it that they're not required here. Mm -hmm.